Hi, this is my second study log on Essential Biology 1 with Portage Learning. So this week I was able to complete two module exams and five lab exams. So that's it for lab exams. There are in total seven lab exams and with five this week and two um, the week before, that's seven. So I completed all the lab exams. So I don't have to worry about the labs for the upcoming week. And for module exams, so far I've been um, doing a lot of handwritten notes to memorize all the new terms for me. There's a lot of new terms. <laughs> maybe just for me, maybe not um, as much for you, but um, I barely remember high school biology, so there's been a lot of um, new vocabularies for me. So I've been doing a lot of handwritten notes for uh, module 1, 2, 3, but module 4 I've been making some... Um, fill in the blank quizzes for myself so I can memorize the terms that way because there's a lot of fill in the blank questions on the actual module exam. So if you're taking this course with Portage, I think um, making some of your own fill in the blank quizzes will help you out also. And I've also been using Quizlet. And I'll share um, those with you in a few. These are the handwritten notes I've written so far. They're on module 2 and module 3 and one page on module 4. But as I've said, I'm switching over to filling the blank quizzes. But um, it's not just filling the blank quizzes. I'm going to do them um, with the handwritten notes. But not as much notes like these because there are a lot of, there are a lot. And um, now I'll show you um, more details about my fill in the blank quizzes and also my Quizlet. So these are the fill in the blank quizzes I made to prepare for my next module exam. I'll put the link to the to download these in the description. So it looks like these, and it comes with an answer key. The answer keys are a nice way to summarize everything in that portion of a uh, module exam. I have two quizzes, one for DNA and one for cell cycle. I still have um, three more portions to summarize, but I might not make um, fill in the blank quizzes for all three of them, just because I don't have time to do all that. Yeah. And it's cute. Look, it's got a flower and a bear. This one's got a cactus and a flower. So this is my Quizlet. I currently have 32 terms organized. Um, I have more terms organized for my um, fill in the blank quizzes just because I thought that was more effective. But this has been really helpful too because Quizlet um, automatically makes um, some questions you can solve. Yeah, so I, like, I added images for adenine and guanine and cytosin and thymine. Okay, all fun stuff. This is my grade so far. So 30 for the first lab exam, 26, and then 27.5, 28, 29.3, and then I'm waiting for um, these two grades. And I got a 94 for my first uh, module exam, which was pretty nice. Then 92 for module 2. And I got the 86.25 for module 3. This is why I decided to switch over from handwritten notes to Quizlet and fill in the blank quizzes I made because I wanted something more than um, 86.25. So hopefully for the next three module exams, I can get um, at least a 90. That's my goal. But we'll see. Okay, so, so far I have 92.07%. And this is my schedule so far. So today is the 19th for me, so I still have the module exam, not module exam, the module problem set to do for, let's see, module 4. And tomorrow I'm planning to take the module 4 exam, and hopefully I'll have all the module exams done until um, next Saturday and then I'll finish up the course on um, Sunday but we'll see how that goes because um, yeah I didn't get the grade I wanted for modules 3 exam that was on the 16th and as you can see I had like 
one to three days to study for it, well, two and a half days. So I think I need a, a little more time to study for these module exams. But I finished double the lab exams this week, so I don't have to study for the lab exams next week. So that's going to help out. Ah, close. So that's it for this video. My next video I'll make once I finish the course. So that will be after I take my final exam and get the grade for it. So I have three module exams to complete and then one final exam. So wish me luck. Bye-bye.